And welcome back to another episode of Assassin's Creed number two. When after weeks of sailing on the wild sea, we arrive in Kingston. Where we're looking for a mystery and sage. Alright, show me where the sucker is. No, I don't need to do anything, dude. Look, you're coming with us. Stop wasting my time. I may tear roof on the rim, but it's all your gap that I do swear. Hey, pal, take on the crew. There, Captain. Jack thanks you hardy. Oh, free hostage. Oh. oh, it's my friend. Here's how it goes. Torres meets with Prince carrying a portion of the ransom saying the rest is close behind. When we see the sage, you bring in the rest of the gold, make the swap and get out. I'll be watching all from close by. No, Kim, you run this scheme alone at the risk of losing the faith of your crew. It makes me ill to think of you bartering with that wretched slaver. Come on, mate. Once we have the sage, we'll all be rich. Not if young Master Kid gets to him first. Kid? Jesus. That lad's here to kill him. Edward, what the hell are you doing here? I'm taming these men to the sage. Can you hold off till he appears? The sage is here. Aye. The prince is leading us straight to him. All right, Jesus. I'll stay in my blade for a time, but not long. Has it been since our last meeting, Senor Prince? A year? Near 18 months. You first described. Oh, you son of a gun. Jim, hold off for God's sake. Edward, what the hell are you doing here? I'm tailing these men to the same. Can you hold off till he appears? The sage is here. Aye. The prince is leading us straight to him. All right, Jesus. Stay in my blood for a time, not long. Alright guys, keep going. Come on, faster, 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 faster. How long has it been since our last meeting, Senor Prince? A year? Near 18 months. You first described this Roberts fellow to me in November of 1715. Come on, guys. Keep walking. Ah, see. Much has changed in that short time. Ah, oh, I was not aware. But I don't envy ah, them. Ah, see. Much has changed in that short time. None called me governor, for instance, where I quit that post last year. So many churches in the You couldn't the help me. English at last taken to converting their slaves to Christian You can't understand. Ah! You're making me nervous, kid. Keep your blades caught. Just my bloody Two major targets, and 
I'm kept from killing him both. Steady, Jim. We're close. Don't worry. So many churches in Kingston. Ah! Convert them! English? How do you mean? We're nearly there. Slave and face corporal punishment like a man. Why act like a man now when you have denied me that right for 30 years? I find your bearing appalling, Prince. I believe all thinking, feeling, and right going again. Deserve respect and opportunity. Ah, oh, you Spaniards. Your long ties to the Moors have diluted your blood and softened your hearts. This is not to say I believe in the natural equality of all races or sexes. Truly, many talent and intelligence should leave. But there is no true profit to be gained by the practice of slavery. In the short term, it makes us money to see. But in the long term, it will render us the victims of our own success. Ah, but you and I, sir, old as we are, will not live to see that unfortunate day. So why bother? Where are you going, guys? Seriously. Watch for your step, boy! For virtue, if nothing else. I hate when these <laughs> missions happen. Oh, they just like keep sorry. walking in the circles for no f I no good no reason. I'm not going to waste my day about slaves and their pitiable condition. Let us conclude this transaction. Then celebrate their friends. Other stories about you, Trusha. You were a governor in Florida for a time. You drew too much attention, can't. Come on. Other stories about you, Trusha. You were a governor in Florida for a time. See, si, see. Si. I am one of a number of civil servants in my family, a long line of politicians. I've always toyed with the idea of entering politics myself. Only I feel I have too much money and not enough years. Speaking of stories, Prince, I've heard it said you were with Henry Morgan the day he sacked Panama. 1671, was it? Oh, it's all true, yes. But let us not overesteem the honors forged and one on the battlefield. That skirmish was a deadly one, and a tremendous waste of coin and resources. It was... Oh my... <laughs> this mission... and the movement of the character, it's so goddamn... Other stories about you, Trusha. You were a governor in Florida for a time. See, si, see. Si. I am one of a number of civil servants in my family, a long line of politicians. I have always toyed with the idea of entering politics myself. Only I feel I have too much money and not enough years. 
Stories, Prince. I've heard it said you were with Henry Morgan the day he sacked Panama. 1671, was it? Oh, it's all true, yes. But let us not overesteem the honors forged and run on the battlefield. That skirmish was a deadly one, and that term. Come on. Thank you. Oh, it's all true, yes. But let us not overesteem the honors forged and won on the battlefield. That skirmish was a deadly one and a tremendous waste of coin and resources. It wasn't until many years after that I sheathed my sword in favor of a far safer and yet more profitable venture. Capital and resources. That's where money is made. And sir, let me tell you, honor bought is more enjoyable than honor won, if a touch less permanent. Okay. Come on, boys. Finish your conversation. Oh, finally. Now's the time. Oh. Not until we see the sage. Here's a quiet spot. I'll see the money. This is a portion of the ransom. The rest is close at hand. It pains me to traffic someone of my own race for profit, Mr. Torres. Tell me again. What has this Robert's fellow done to upset you? Is this some form of Protestant piety I'm not familiar with? Perhaps another day. What? Next time, see to it that we are not followed! Deal with this! Ah, oh, gosh. Kill Kenway for a better cause. Hey, got him. Uh, in. I'm going after Prince. Kid, no. Jim, stop. Oh, my. Don't go in my way, people. Come on, man. We can work this together. You have your chance. Your blade, kid. Wait. Oh, my God, your stupid bombs. Jim, stop. Damn you, old scratch. Keep your natty hands off me. I can't let you kill those men, kid. Not until I found the sage. I've been stalking that pig for a week now, charting his moves, and here I find not one but two of my targets, and you robbed me of both. Patience, man. You'll have your kills. When I locate the sage, you're helping me take Prins. Got that? All right. Deal then, I guess. Just calm down a little bit. All right, what do we need to do now? Where are we? Need? Ooh, hello. There's a windmill. Oh, bother. What are you on about? 
What are we gonna do here? Okay, looks like we need to go up the windmill. the wrong way can I climb on this thing no okay negative apparently negative here as well okay I guess we need to go this way then. Ah, okay. That's what I thought, that I need to use the... Oh, you went up the air, okay. Fort 4. You prefer meeting in a pub? I came to Kingston chasing a target. Getting pissed ain't a priority. We could work together on this, you know. It's Lawrence Prince you're after. I want his prisoner. We're after the sage as well, Edward. Careful who you cross. May the best man win. There's guards patrolling that property from end to end. Looks to me like they use bells to signal trouble. See there? We'll want to disable those before pushing too far. With so many men about, we can't rely on stealth alone, so... I'll do what I can to distract and draw their attention. Giving you a chance to cut them down. Ready? Your name's not James, is it? Not most days. Come on. What the hell? He looks like a girl. All right. All righty. Let's get the bell first. I think. Hey, wasn't that Spanish fella meant to come up here for a visit? Torres or something? You didn't hear what happened? He was attacked by a couple of brigands on his way here. Buccaneers or the like. A nasty business. Jesus. You are right. Slipped away. I heard Okay. What the hell? I got shot once and almost died. Guy. Oh, no. Ah, that was terrible. I've really messed up there, huh? If 
you see Prince before I do, kill him, and there'll be a bit of coin in it for you. All right. I'm not after coin, but sure. Jesus, is he all right? Slipped away from what I heard. Prince ain't too happy neither. Hey man, he died. Hey man, you died as well. Not hundred percent sure about this guy. Turn around and I can sabotage this thing. Those guys annoy me. Be this guy. Uh. Where do we have another bell? Up there and one over there. Okay. So let's get over there. Going down. Oh. Perfect. Idea situation, guys. Thank you very much. So nothing. Interloper, raise the alarm. What? Come on. Come to Papa. How are you going?
These stupid towers, man. And we're gonna loot the chest as well. Why not, right? Danzo as well. Nobody knows anything. <laughs> Hold! Stand your ground! Please! I've been shot! I need aid! Christ, Thompson, look at her! She's hurt! Dreadfully, sir! I'm poorly! All right! I'm faint! Take an arm, lass! Bless you, lads! Oh, hello. Somebody is too trustworthy. Oi! Mortal! Mr. Prince says to keep your eyes peeled tonight. Is there some men about bent and making trouble? I'll spread the word! All right, let us just do it. Oh, probably don't want to go that way. Slightly unwanted, but we managed the situation quite well. Okay, give me a treasure. Looting here. You say something, boy. This ain't no time for chatter, you hear? I ain't say nothing, sir. You got no clothes. And the one guy down. Look up once more, and it'll be the last damn thing you ever see. No problem here. I'm working as best I can. Disable this or just in case. So you can ring for help. And you done so, you prick. Over me like a leering crow to see an old man suffer. You've caused no small portion of suffering yourself, Mr. Prince. Retribution, I suppose. You absurd cutthroats and your precious philosophy. You live in the world, but you cannot make it move. You mistake my motive, old man. I'm only after a bit of coin. <laughs> As was I, lad. As was I. Oh well, you're not gonna get any coin anymore. Heads up, Kenway! I found your man! I remember you, the Templar from Havana. I'm no Templar, mate. That was just a ruse. We've come here to save your ass from this slaver. Save me? I work for Mr. Prince. 
Well, then he's a poor man to call master. He meant to sell you out to the Templars. Oh, you can't trust anyone, it seems. <laughs> Alright, you think that's gonna stop me? Jumping on the trees. Uh, what the hell's happening? Why are you not goddamn running? Oh my god. This gave us. Come on, I'm trying to. <laughs> clear shot, huh? Uh, run. Run for your life. Oh, what the hell's going on? Hey! Oh. Are they actually going away? You cannot do. Don't know which way. Come on, boys. Hey, lady. Lost your man again, did you? Aye. Roberts is a devil with a queer aversion to kindness. I suppose that's two men I've lost today. So, what's your real name, lass? Mary Reed to my mum. And them I call friends. But not a word of it to anyone. Or I'll unman you as well. Alrighty boys, welcome to the end of the episode. I hope you guys enjoyed, let me know down in the comments if you did. Leave a like, leave a comment, and if you don't want to miss the next episode, please subscribe and I hope you guys catch you then, because this one has been rad.